Hey everybody, just today they released all the information and unboxed the Collector's Edition for Black Ops 2 and I have that video coming up shortly for you but first I want to show some fan appreciation and we are going to be giving one of these bad boys away. So all you gotta do for a chance to win the Black Ops 2 Collector's Edition is comment down below Black Ops 2 PS3 or Black Ops 2 Xbox, whatever console you are on, and if you can, I would really appreciate a like on this video for all this this pistol owning that I'm doing right here. Two things in my hand like a champion. Thanks for watching, guys, and enjoy the unboxing. Hey everyone, I'm Mark Lamia, the studio head here at Treyarch, and I'm here with David Vonderhaar, the game design director, and we, uh, we have something very special we want to share with you. There it is. This is it. The collector's edition, the care package. It's straight from the game. It's modeled uh, right out of the game, um, you know, for the fans. So uh, what do you say we show them what's inside? Let's do that. All right. No ammo, no ammo, no ammo. Pro tip, there is no ammo crate drop in Call of Duty Black Ops 2 multiplayer. There you go. All right, inside, what have we got? Well, with Black Ops, is uh, for the collector's edition, as you know, we made the RCXD remote control car. We wanted to outdo ourselves. We wanted to give you guys something that would be awesome, something that we wanted ourselves. Um, and that is the Dragon Fire, remote control Dragon Fire. So why don't you say, let's just take this thing for the flight. Why don't we do that? You got it. All right, there it is right there. Vaughn is a trained professional. Awesome. Nice work. Thank you. All right. So uh, the remote control dragon fire. It's gonna. It's you know. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Um, and you know, I think fans are gonna love that. All right. So what else have we got for you here? All right. Of course, we have the steel book. And uh, this has got some exclusive artwork for you guys here. Um, you know, on this steel book, it's awesome looking. And for the very first time, for Zombies fans, you get your own cover here. So, um, you know, really excited about this. It looks awesome. Um, thanks to you Zombies fans, we got something for you guys. So, something for everyone. Um, oh, wait, let me show you inside. Oh, there's, oh what? There's, there's, okay, awesome artwork, no disc yet. After we're done with this, we're going to get back to work and uh, get that for you. All right, so there we go. What else have we got? We have we have some challenge coins. Yeah, the challenge coins are awesome. In fact, I have two of them right here. The first challenge coin has the Call of Duty Black Ops 2 logo. It's that skull icon that I really like. And on the back, the two, or as Mr. Lamy likes to refer to it as, the deuce. But Mark, this is my favorite coin. This coin has the deuce on one side, but has the dragon fire on the back. And, and, and on there, there's, a, there's a, a unique code there, right? Yeah, that's right. This is etched right here at the top of this coin, and that is how you will get all of the downloadable content that comes with this package. Right, so when we were thinking of you know, what we wanted to give to you guys, um, we thought of all kinds of digital content. So why don't we tell them about the first piece? It is a long list of great stuff. It includes the soundtrack from our composer, Jack Wall, and that includes the theme from Trent Reznor. Man, it's amazing. Yeah, it's an epic soundtrack. Um, we went to Abbey Road Studios to do recording on that, and you know Trent Reznor is of course awesome. So, anyways, great stuff with that. What, what, what? Tell them what else we got. Yeah, so there's actually in-game content as well for multiplayer. You'll get an exclusive weapon camouflage that comes with this package for use in game. Yeah, that thing's totally badass. It, it ha takes on uh, the design and styling that we use with all of this. So it's got this, you know, this, this orange outline is really picked up here and it looks really cool. Yeah, it's absolutely badass, Mark. So you get more though too. You get n not one, but two player cards. The emblem editor is making a return. It's coming back in a really big way with lots of new features. You can use these images as part of that identity they're inspired by Nuketown 2025 and Call of Duty Zombies. Yeah, so um, not only do you get the editor, but I know there's other in-game content that we've been working on, and I want you to tell them about that too. Yeah, so you guys know about Nuketown 2025. You're going to love this version of Nuketown 2025. Reimagined for the future, but completely the experience that you would expect from that map. 
but there's actually something more. Yeah, this is straight from the community. Uh, you've been asking for it for a while, so we're gonna give it to, give it to uh, our fans. Tell them about it, collectors. Yeah, in the collector's edition, it's Nuketown Zombies. Right. So, um, you know, uh, you know, so one of our fa one of our fans' favorite maps. Playing it in zombies is gonna be awesome. It's awesome. So, um, you know, all this content here. You know, the way we went about it is we thought about what we would want and uh, knowing what you guys want and, uh, and, and we're delivering it. And this package is awesome. So, um, but we also have more here. So uh, we also have a hardened edition, right? So, and the hardened edition has everything that we talked about, except of course the care package itself and, and the dragon fire, the remote control dragon fire. But you know, it's got this awesome box here. Right, and when you open it up inside, you can display it. It's got this steel book here for fans, and then of course it has the challenge coins, which is the gateway to a lot of that digital content, and uh, you know that you were talking about. So, um, really, uh, again, it's too. You know, we wanted to give you guys the choice of of whichever one you wanted, and just as, as our way of saying thank you, we put a lot of stuff in here, and we're really excited about it. So, thank you guys very much, and uh, we're going to get back to work. Got to finish that game.